Philadelphia Flower Show will soon be in full bloom, and for the first time in the show's 193-year history, it'll be held outdoors. The show will span the beautiful vistas and rolling landscape of FDR Park in South Philadelphia and promises to be the biggest flower show ever. Here to tell us more is Sam Lem Henny, the chief of shows and events for the Pennsylvania Horticultural Society. Sam, the show is traditionally held indoors in March, so this year is a big change. Talk about what we can expect and some of the major highlights. Oh yeah, this is a huge change for us, and uh, we are so excited to be down here at FDR Park. The folks from Parks and Recreation and the, all the folks down here at FDR Park have been just welcoming us. Um, we've been setting up for a couple of weeks now, and we're uh, we're in the final stages, and we can't wait for everybody to come down and join us at FDR. Um, you know, if you haven't got your tickets yet, go get them because we're we're gonna have such a blast down here. The weather's looking really good, looking like the rain's gonna hold away. Might be a little warm, but uh, it's gonna be beautiful down here. The birds are chirping, the leaves are green, the flowers will be blooming. So this is gonna be beautiful. Oh yeah, it certainly is a fitting backdrop for this. Uh, and people, they come from all over the country, even other parts of the world, to experience the flower show. Describe the flower power, if you will, that this show has had and uh, the theme this year. So this year's theme is Habitat, Nature's Masterpiece. Um, you know, the Pennsylvania Horticultural Society has always known the impact that plants have on your health and well-being and their neighborhoods. And uh, this year's Habitat really will be how the exhibitors will be interpreting that and how it impacts you individually, how it impacts you from a neighborhood standpoint and a community standpoint, and how plants impact the, the world and the ecosystem. And so that's really the, the main thrust of this flower show this year. And we no better place than outdoors um, and, and doing this show outdoors than have a habitat theme. So we're really excited about that. And we got lucky. We picked that theme about three years ago. And we, we always do that well in advance so we can work through this. So when we moved outside, Took us about two seconds to figure out that hey, this is going to be still the great theme that we have for outside. So, um, really excited about what the all the exhibitors and how they're interpreting this theme. I love it, and I love this theme. It's so fitting because you know when the world was on lockdown, the flowers they were not; they were still in bloom. Uh, do you expect this outdoor tradition to continue for years to come? Uh, yeah, it's a good question. We we you know talking about how many people joined in the horticulture and gardening world. Uh, National Gardening Association just released their survey. 18.2 million people turned to plants to get them through the pandemic, all new. And I, there's probably so many more that did that. And we know that here at PHS, we know that that's what uh, people do. And, and plants can really bring you back to nature and really be a, have a calming effect on you. And so that really has been a big benefit to the horticulture industry. And uh, we're, we're excited to the flower show will be a celebration of that. And first time, probably many people are getting outside and and really seeing seeing the outdoors for, for in, a, in a large crowd. So we can't wait for people to come to the show. And you know what we're thinking about next year? We, we haven't made a decision yet, but we'll, we'll, we'll let everybody know soon once we make that decision. Love it. The options are endless. The Philadelphia Flower Show begins this Saturday, June 5th, and runs through Sunday, June 13th at FDR Park in South Philadelphia. Timed tickets are needed. And, of course, you can get more details in the Philly Live section of NBC10.com or the NBC10 app.